Hi, I'm here to talk to you about uh, an Infinity Fall application, a use pattern that is becoming more popular in Eastern Canada for their winter wheat. And there are a couple of benefits why you should consider it. One of them is, uh, is a fairly obvious one is when we spray in the, in the fall here, plants are actively growing. Uh, they haven't set a really large root system, so we're able to really get the chemical to translocate into the root system versus when we decide to come back in the springtime, by that time we're really hitting the new growth and the chemical doesn't always work its way down into the root system. The other benefit obviously is when they're overwintering, you know, the root system gets quite large and by the time we get to spray in the spring, a lot of these uh, winter annuals or win overwintering weeds are really getting quite large by the time we're able to come in and spray them. And we're really starting to push a herbicide. Herbicides are really our design when we look at them to target small actively growing weeds. And by the time we often do that in springtime, and I know being in Eastern Canada even this year in the spring, I'm seeing flowering, dan flowering dandelions. When we're trying to hit flowering dandelions, we are getting too late for a lot of the herbicides. So, it's something to consider coming in the fall, hit them early, hit them young, and you'll get better results. And I can tell you from some of the people that have done this fall application, sometimes you haven't even had to come back with a broadleaf in the springtime. That won't be the case all the time, but it's certainly something to consider. The other one, which is a key weed, certainly in Eastern Canada we see in winter cereals, is chickweed. Uh, it's very cold tolerant. What does that mean? It means coming into the springtime, it's up and growing before the winter wheat. So by the time you're really getting in for that herbicide application, again, it's quite a large weed. So we're really starting to push a herbicide. So again, another option is to go in early in the, here in the fall and take control of that tough to kill weed. Obviously the one that we're all, we all talk a lot about in Eastern Canada, we hear about it a lot, is, is Canada fleabane. Another one, again, that's predominantly a, a fall or winter annual, but there is some spring annuals. Um, but the, it's the winter annual that really sets the number of seeds. You know, a 1.5 metre plant of Canada fleabane, if we don't take control of it, can produce up to 250,000 seeds. So that's your weed bank you're going to deal with the year after. So let's really try and tackle it now. The spring germinate ones don't produce quite as many seeds, but still they still produce a significant amount. So I really encourage you to talk to your retailer, talk to your agronomist, talk to the Bayer representative about the option of infinity in the fall. It really is a, an option that people are starting to really look at.